Race walking, or race walking, is a long-distance discipline within the sport of athletics. Although it is a foot race, it is different from running in that one foot must appear to be in contact with the ground at all times. This is assessed by race judges, making it the most subjective of the disciplines in athletics. Typically held on either roads or on running tracks, common distances vary from 3,000 meters up to 100 kilometers. There are two race walking distances contested at the Summer Olympics, the 20 km race walk and 50 km race walk. Both are held as road events. The biennial IAAF World Championships in Athletics also features the same three events. The IAAF World Race Walking Cup, first held in 1961, is a standalone global competition for the discipline and it has 10 km race walks for junior athletes, in addition to the Olympic standard events. The IAAF World Indoor Championships featured 5000M and 3000M race walk variations, but these were discontinued after 1993. Top level athletics championships and games typically feature 20 km race walking events. The sport emerged from a British culture of long distance competitive walking known as pedestrianism, which began to develop the rule set that is the basis of the modern discipline around the mid 19th century. Watching people walk was America's favorite spectator sport in the late 19th century. Since the mid 20th century onwards, Russian and Chinese athletes have been among the most successful on the global stage, with Europe and parts of Latin America producing most of the remaining top level walkers. Compared to other forms of foot racing, stride length is reduced. To achieve competitive speeds race walkers must attain cadence rates comparable to those achieved by world-class 800 meters runners. Rules There are two rules that govern race walking. The first dictates that the athlete's back toe cannot leave the ground until the heel of the front foot has touched. Violation of this rule is known as loss of contact. The second rule requires that the supporting leg must straighten from the point of contact with the ground and remain straightened until the body passes directly over it. These rules are judged by the unaided human eye. Athletes regularly lose contact for a few milliseconds per stride, which can be caught on film, but such a short flight phase is said to be undetectable to the human eye. Athletes stay low to the ground by keeping their arms pumping low, close to their hips. If one sees a race walker's shoulders rising, it may be a sign that the athlete is losing contact with the ground. What appears to be an exaggerated swivel to the hip is, in fact, a full rotation of the pelvis. Athletes aim to move the pelvis forward and to minimize sideways motion in order to achieve maximum forward propulsion. Speed is achieved by stepping quickly with the aim of rapid turnover. This minimizes the risk of the feet leaving the ground. Strides are short and quick, with push-off coming forward from the ball of the foot, again to minimize the risk of losing contact with the ground. World-class race walkers can average under 4 and 5 minutes per kilometer in a 20-kilometer race walk. Distances Races have been walked at distances as short as 3 kilometers a euro at the 1920 Summer Olympics a euro, and as long as 100 kilometers. The men's world record for the 50-mile race walk is held by Israeli Shaw Ladani, whose time of 7.23 and 50 seconds in 1972 beat the world record that had stood since 1935. The modern Olympic events are the 20 km race walk and 50 km race walk. Judges There are judges on the course to monitor form. Three judges submitting red cards for violations results in disqualification. There is a scoreboard placed on the course so competitors can see their violation status. If the third violation is received, the chief judge removes the competitor from the course by showing a red paddle. For monitoring reasons, races are held on a looped course or on a track so judges get to see competitors several times during a race. A judge could also caution a competitor that he or she is in danger of losing form by showing a paddle that indicates either losing contact or bent knees. No judge may submit more than one card for each walker and the chief judge may not submit any cards. It is his or her job only to disqualify the offending walker. Disqualifications are routine at the elite level, such as the famous case of Jane Seville disqualified within sight of a gold medal in front of her home crowd in the 2000 Summer Olympics. Beginnings 
race walking developed as one of the original track and field events of the first meeting of the English Amateur Athletics Association in 1880. The first race walking codes come from an attempt to regulate rules for popular 19th century long distance competitive walking events, called pedestrianism. Pedestrianism had developed, like foot races and horse racing, as a popular working class British and American pastime, and a venue for wagering. Walkers organized the first English Amateur Walking Championship in 1866, which was won by John Chambers, and judged by the Fair Heel and Toe Rule. This rather vague code was the basis for the rules codified at the first championships meeting in 1880 of the Amateur Athletics Association in England, the birth of modern athletics. With football, cricket, and other sports codified in the 19th century, the transition from professional pedestrianism to amateur race walking was, while relatively late, part of a process of regularization occurring in most modern sports at this time. Olympics Race walking is an Olympic athletics event with distances of 20 km for both men and women and 50 km for men only. Race walking first appeared in the modern Olympics in 1904 as a half mile walk in an all rounder, the precursor to the 10 event decathlon. In 1908, Standalone 1,500m and 3,000m race walks were added, and a Euro excluding 1924 a Euro there has been at least one race walk in every Olympic since. The women's race walk became an Olympic event only in 1992, following years of active lobbying by female internationals. A World Cup in race walking is held biennially, and race walk events appear in the IAAF Athletics World Championships the Commonwealth Games and the Pan American Games, among others. World Race Walking Challenge Since 2003, the IAAF has organized an annual worldwide competition series in which elite athletes accumulate points for the right to compete in the IAAF Race Walking Challenge final and to share over US$200,000 of prize money. The series of televised events takes place in several countries each year including Mexico, Spain, Russia and China. High school, race walking is sometimes included in high school and or and outdoor track meets, the rules often more relaxed. The distances walked tend to be relatively short, with the 1500m being the most commonly held event. Racing also occurs at 3 km, 5 km and 10 km, with records kept and annual rankings published. Top performers. Equals men equals. 20 km. 50 kilometers equals women equals 20 kilometers 1 these times were achieved without the presence of international judges to officiate the competition and or post race doping tests thus making them invalid for world record status however they are accepted as personal best marks for those athletes in popular culture race walking is often derided and made fun of as a contrived or artificial sport in 1992 long-time Olympic commentator Bob Costas compared it to a competition for who can whisper the loudest. Film, Dr. Detroit Dan Aykroyd uses race walking as a vehicle to emphasize his nerdy professor character. Walk Don't Run, a 1966 Cary Grant movie, revolving around race walking at the 1964 Tokyo Olympics. When Harry met Sally Billy Crystal walks in Central Park, Are We Done Yet? Starring Ice Cube and John C. McGinley, the eccentric jerk of all trades contractor who is also a former professional race walker. Television, Almost Live. Features a regular sketch of the speed walker, played by Bill Nye as a superhero who fights crime while adhering to the competitive rules. Malcolm in the Middle, Episode Number 70. Hal takes up race walking and discovers that one of the competitors had been cheating. Video games. Homesterunner.com, 50k race walker. A game where the player must race walk 50 kilometers in order to win, requiring more than 20 hours to complete. See also, fight walking, pedestrianism, power walking, summer Olympics, walking. References, notes. External links, racewalk.com, high school race walking, race walking recorder Euro News, photos and reports all about race walking. World Masters Race Walking Rankings, Race Walk UK, Race Walk Australia, The Walking Site Equibay Walking Pages, Swiss Walking Federation, Official Website, 
Centurion's History, Magazines, Race Walking Record, Walk Magazine